quite discovered with horror the meanness of her stepmother's intentions. But our pure and innocent princess is protected by a good star. Thanks to the generous Samson, her life was spared, and she miraculously found shelter in the cottage owned by seven kind dwarfs. Now she lives with them, welcomed as a member of an already numerous and happy family. the help, not me. Oh, no, out of the question, Snow White. Why don't you go for a walk in the woods? It's very nice there. Why don't you go with her, Jolly? Me? It's not a bad idea. Oh. Oh. Um. Do you mind going ahead a little? alone for a moment. Uh? I forgot something at home, but I'll be right back. All right, but I'll wait for you here. Fine. <laughs> now I'll find out why they wanted me to keep her away from home. I am sure Snow White will be surprised when she comes back and finds this wonderful cake I'm baking for her. She'll certainly like it better than Woody's bed, that's for sure. I'm going to knit a soft and warm woolen jacket for her. Now why is she so tall? It'll take me ages to finish this, but if I work hard, maybe I can finish it by next winter. It may not be as nice as Woody's wooden bed, but it's the thought that counts. Vet is also doing something. The others must be doing something, too. I found it by accident in a crack of the stone. As far as I know, girls like to wear the same stuff. Huh? I was thinking about giving it to Snow White. What do you say? Our princess will like it, right? Hmm. <laughs> Aha, perfume you say. Yeah, well, I mixed flower essences boiled with aromatic herbs and obtained this delicate perfume. It would be a pity to throw it away, so I said to myself, why not give it to our new guest? Believe me, it was accidental. Accident or not, everyone, in a way, has gifts for Snow White. I must find one, too. <laughs> she is a real princess, kind and sweet. I would take the moon to give it to her, or walk miles just to get her some water. Believe me. <laughs> What's up, man? Nothing. For a second, I had the impression Jolly was around. Oh, <laughs> but I guess it was just my imagination. What rascals! They didn't say a word to me. Each one of them has a gift for Snow White. It's all Woody's fault. He built that secret bed. <sighs> I would like to have a surprise for her, but I don't know her taste. I know she loves everything in the nature. I could offer to stand by her and protect her from every danger. But I'm not that strong, after all. Oh. Oh. If only I had a special gift to give. Like Gourmet, or for example. Or like Woody. Oh. Trust in yourself. Trust in yourself. Huh? I hear the voice. Oh. Oh. 
I wonder what's taking him so long. I'm almost falling asleep. Hmm. Oh! <laughs> I should have known that this walnut was yours, little one. I'm happy you came to keep me company. I'm here to meet Jolly. Do you see him anywhere? Find my good friend. Oh, Snow White, did you hurt yourself? Thank God I'm all right. Don't worry, Jolly. Here, I picked these for you. Oh, you are very kind. Oh. They not only look beautiful, but they also have an extraordinary perfume. Something wrong, Jolly? Nothing at all fancy like my friends are doing. I tried to think of something since I found out everyone is preparing a gift for you. What? Uh, Are you sure of what you're telling me? Absolutely. Gourmet is preparing a delicious cake. Vet is knitting as fast as he can. Goldie is making precious earrings. And chamomile a bottle of perfume. I can't believe it. I'm the one who should be preparing presents for all of you who have been so nice to me. You are so sweet that it's just natural that we want to cover you with presents. Since you arrived, our house is full of joy and tenderness. I am touched by this. I have an idea. I want to pick some more flowers, Jolly. I'm going to prepare a surprise for everyone, too. What? Well, yes, if you want to. Yes, I do. Let's go. A flower gem? Are you sure you know how to make it? Of course, and I must say it tastes really good. I don't believe it. Well, we'll see about that. I know I'm not as good a cook as gourmet, but on the other hand, I'm not a bad cook either. Didn't Woody like the soup that I made for him the other day? Well, yes, but it's also true that gourmet helped you along. All right then, since you're so skeptical, I won't even let you try hey, it. Hey, wait for me, Snow White! Why did you stop? I have the impression we've already passed here. Yes, it's strange. I also think so. Are we lost? Yes, but don't worry. <clears throat> Let's take a break to have lunch, <clears throat> friends. Oh, it's about time, man. I'm oh, sorry. yeah. Oh, we're going to eat. Me first. Me first. Hey, hey, hey it's Guys, terrible. where are you? Carme and Vet are here. Hey, what happened? It's Jolly and Snow White. They went for a walk and didn't come back. Oh. The princess is mature and always on time. And Jolly would never skip a meal. This is really weird. Oh my, we must go now. Let's split up and look for them in the woods. Hey, let's go Let's go quickly. Let's go. I made. It means we've already passed through this way, so now we are completely lost. Please be calm, Jolly. It's all right, and we'll find our way back home. It is useless. They are all dead ends. We are prisoners of the forest. Courage. Cheer up. You'll do it. Huh? What was that? I think it's the flowers. They are speaking to us. It's around here somewhere. Hey, Jolly, wait. Don't leave me here all alone. Oh, Jolly! I'm coming. I'm coming. Princess! Jolly! Jolly! Boss! Hey, boss! Did you find them? No, not yet. Ah. Where could they be, man? Oh, I think I have a clue. Quickly! Tell us, Tell us huh? Huh? Prick gets restless when he hears Snow White's name. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, I've never seen a flower like this. As far as I know, these don't grow around this forest, man. That means they're near the ravine. The ravine? Oh. The ravine? Well, everyone knows how hard it is to reach that place. Let's go. Yes, yes, yes we have no time to lose. Let's go. Jolly. Yoo-hoo, Jolly. Jolly, answer me. If you're playing,
saying this is not funny. Jolly, I beg you, don't leave me here alone. Jolly! Snow White! <gasps> Over here, hurry up! I'm coming. Wait for me. Here we are. This is it. Oh. They're wonderful. I have never seen anything like this before. So pretty and magical. Dear Flowers, please allow me to collect some of you so that I may make a beautiful bouquet to give to my friends, the Seven Dwarfs. Thank you with all my heart. Now you will be able to prepare your delicious jam. Yes, but we still have to find our way back. We home. arrived here by that path. We just have to take the opposite direction. Oh, my flowers! Oh, where, where are you going? Snow White! Snow White! Come, Jolly! Watch out! Oh! Can't hold on much longer. Jolly! Help! Help! I can't hold on longer! Oh, help me! Help! Oh. 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 Woody! Stop crying and hold on tight! Woody! Jolly! Princess! Go help Woody! Goldie! Quick! Right away! Beth and Gourmet, get that thick grass and tie it around your wrist! Yes! I'll help you, Ben. Throw the flowers away, Snow White. You must grab them with both hands. No, I can't throw them away. Hurry, my friends. Pass the rope or Snow White's fingers will give in. The rope's ready. Take it. We must tie it around Snow White's waist. Huh? Really? What are you waiting for? Let's go save them. All right, let's go. Hurry, Snow White has no more strength. Okay, we'll do our best. Oh! Oh! Well done, my friend. Great, now let's pull her up together. Together! 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 together. 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 Princess, Princess, please wake up! Oh, Princess, it's me! Oh, oh, she's, she's, she's awake! awake. She's awake, I was so worried! She's safe! I got so worried! Oh, the flowers, the way back home! I'm here! Jolly, you're here! Oh, thank goodness you're all right! Here are your special Jolly. flowers! I was so scared! Why did you go all the way there? You should only take a walk in the woods and then go home. Oh, I wanted to pick these flowers as a gift to you. To show you my gratitude for all you have done. I found out you were preparing a surprise, so I decided to do one too. I convinced Jolly to help me and guide me all the way here. Jolly! Oh, he, he told, told you! you. Uh, well, I know what you're thinking. I didn't mean to tell her anything. It was my tongue. I'm, I'm innocent. Uh... He's a big man. He talks way too much. You know, thanks for having told me, Jolly. <laughs> Princess, where is your pin? Did you lose it? Huh? Oh, my goodness. Help me find my pin. I love that pin. It was a present from Richard. What? Where? 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 I can't believe I lost it. Where is it? I don't see it. Uh, somewhere. Where I is don't this? See it. Over there in that Me porch. neither. Well, it's got to be here somewhere. Look over there. Right here. Where is it? Right here. I must find it. We look for it everywhere. 
Unfortunately, there's a very good chance it fell down into the ravine. Let's look again in the places we've been. No, it's useless. Uh, but it might be... Thank you very much, Jolly. I like that pin a lot, but it's nothing more than a pin. I know you'll find it. Flowers commonly called hope. They appear miraculously, and as soon as they come, they give strength and courage to desperate hearts, man. I haven't seen them for at least a couple of centuries. I thought they had disappeared forever. Look, it's Pick! Oh, 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 Thank you, Pick. You're wonderful. The Flowers of Hope probably told Pick to protect your pin and bring it here to you. Thank you, Flowers of Hope. Thank you for helping me find my pin. On the menu this evening is the jam I lovingly prepared with the flowers of hope we encountered while in the forest earlier. Here for you, boss. Vet. This one for you, Goldie. Gourmet. Chamomile. Woody. And last but certainly not least, the dear silly one I care for so much, Jolly. Oh! If it wasn't for me, you would be at the bottom of the ravine. If you care for your life, you'd better watch your step, princess. And who was the one who took me deep into the woods, or don't you remember? Who insisted on going with her? What are you saying? Oh. Oh. You didn't even try the dessert I made. You are right. We haven't eaten yet. Oh, my cake is burning. What will we eat? It's ruined. Oh, my beautiful cake is ruined. What will we eat? Actually, at the mine, we haven't eaten either. True, and we're all starving. Oh, we're starving. starving. The seven dwarfs ate plenty that day. Lunch and dinner at once. Dear Richard, not a minute goes by that I don't think of you. Strangely, when I lost your pin, I felt so badly, although I know it's just a jewel. Many bad things have happened in my life. The death of my mother, my father's marriage, the distance from my friends, the departure of Molly, my nanny. And you, Richard, where are you right now? My beloved Richard. Huh? Is there something wrong, Richard? It's strange. I thought I heard a voice calling my name. Huh? The Flowers of Hope will help Richard meet Snow White once again. 